Welcome back. Let's play some 10 minute games here on Shogi Wars. Good luck. Alright, today I'm feeling like playing third file rook just for fun. Um forget what the best way to handle this is. And perhaps there's multiple ways, multiple good ways to handle it. I should have pushed this. Because I'm aware that my opponent wants to put their rook here. I should have anticipated that. Um, so here we are. Maybe I'll transition to something else. So now I've moved my silver. I still don't know where their king is going to sit eventually. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking of transitioning to some kind of something where this position is cut in half in the middle. Um, that's a target, isn't it? They have the rook and the bishop adjacent, so what's going to defend this? Is the rook going to defend this? It's like they've went out of their way to protect against me invading on this file. So I pick a different file, right? That's how it works. In this case, a rook drop looks crushing, so this could be interesting. All right, the rook is floating. Let's attack it. Okay, let's take a rook. Let's get it Arguably, we both made mistakes that game. Um... We all make mistakes, right? Good luck. Bishop exchange is their favorite opening. I wonder what's about to happen. So this a lot of my squares are loose now. Interesting. Oh, yeah, I've overconcentrated my forces, haven't I? Hmm. Okay. Let's leave this open as a possibility. If I had a pawn, we'd have an easy target. I do not have a pawn. So here we are. Oh. Well, that's news. Isn't it? Okay. Interesting. All right, this certainly indicates exchanges will occur. Let's do it. Why not? My rook is on file four. It's all lined up to attack stuff, so let's seize the day, right? Sure, maybe I should have pushed this earlier. I don't know. Um...
I do have a one pawn advantage, but they're about to have a horse and things are about to get messy. If this horse retreats, I can drop a bishop here. And that forks the horse as well as the knight. If the bishop doesn't retreat, then I don't know what they're doing. Maybe there is some urgent attack somewhere, but I just don't see it. Let me check my overlay. It looks fine. Okay, let's do this fork. And what's the comeuppance? What have I overlooked? Okay. Um, I have another fork. So this attacks a knight and a lance. The knight is defended. The lance is not defended. Let's take a lance. Now, if they had another lance, this would be a different story. But I think it's okay. Things are about to get messy. The opponent has a pawn and a bishop. Alright, let's get this rolling and promote my rook. Stay on target. Again, if they had another lance, I'd have reason for concern, but they don't have a second lance. Okay, my threat to promote Nanafun. is cut short here. Um, hmm. How do I break their shape? Do I just literally go for it? Like, what else can I try? I guess I could offer a rook exchange, but that does... Well, a rook exchange would help, actually, if I could sack here and take a silver. I missed that. This is dangerous um, and potentially not rewarding. Getting a rook, however, would allow me to exchange for two generals. They would block somehow here, uh, but it would give us both something to consider. Instead, I've given them more or less a free shot at me, because um, this doesn't hit in time. I was banking on being able to run the rook somewhere if the silver moves up, although I had not resolved on all the details there. Um, hmm, I can again offer a rook exchange. It still looks interesting. They'll probably just take this pawn. And then I can take here and keep pushing. Well, if I take again, they drop a pawn back here, don't they? So this is not only an empty threat, 
but a less than empty threat. <laughs> cool beans. All right. Um. <laughs> well, damn. Um, this didn't work at all how I thought. Okay. Um. Let's keep with the plan. It's not a good plan, but the rook wasn't doing any good barricaded here. It's doing marginally less good here. Yes, everything is hanging now, but I think it's fine. What are they going to do with the rook? Probably drop it here. I don't think that actually does. Well, this is a fork. It is spooky. Um... Hmm. I thought I had this planned out. Maybe I don't. Yeah, this is terrible. This is ridiculously awful. Go Um. All right. I'll defend my king. And pretend that was part of the plan. It's not a very good plan at all. <laughs> this is such a terrible plan. Okay, at least we get the dragon at the end. This is so terrible. Yep, now they get to... Oh, never mind. They don't care about my horse. Nor should they. Alright, let's attack this target. They'll drop here. I'll take the knight and have some kind of consecutive attack. But, um... It's such a mess. This should never have happened. Okay, that's debatable. Uh, interesting. Why would you do that? I mean, you could argue the same about my moves, but still. If I drop the gold down and they move a... Oh, of course I put it here. Why would I do that? Do I just want to lose? Is that it? Hmm. This is so bad. Well, at least now, if there's a fork, uh, the rook is defending itself. This is... I don't know. It's gradually coming back together. It's still atrocious. Um... Removing one for one doesn't, well, doesn't seem to do anything. This adds a defender without, I mean, it doesn't make an attack, but I don't think it worsens this situation. It probably doesn't help much. Other than they'll need to line up another attacker, and I'll need another defender. So it goes. But I don't think they've hit the critical mass where I'm checkmated just yet, because they did invest heavily in defense here. 
They can collect my horse at any time. And this edge is also, like, not great. So I'm not doing this right. Let me check. Do I have my mic on? Mic is on. Cool. Um, so, yeah, I don't know, man. If I could bring in more pieces to attack without them having more pieces to defend, that would be great. I don't see that being feasible here. I do want to promote this pawn and use it to break in, but that's so slow. So that's why I'm resorting to this extremely slow defense that doesn't do anything to help my attack. It's because I think I have time for it. If they drop a bishop hitting both of these points, I think I can defend this gold and attack this way. Um, but they'll drop another pawn and I just won't have an attack. Okay, I mean, that's similar to what I was suggesting. Um, I still don't have an attack. Sampun. They're just going to drop something here to defend. My attack's too far away from their king. Okay, that is attacking. Um, I think this adequately defends. It sucks to defend. But I just don't seem to have an attack here. Maybe I should have dropped a silver somewhere up here to attack earlier. Their point is if I take the knight, they've already got a horse defending their king, and also attacking my king, and that's a very good point. It's moves like that that, make, that help you get one done. Or help you keep it. Um, hmm... I don't have a knight in hand. This is bad. Um, all right, I need to believe in my attack. So we're going to believe in it. Here goes nothing.
30秒。Reading is hard. Reading is so hard. Two down, one to go. Thank you. Good luck. Oh wow! I wonder how many people have broken hearts from that kind of an experience. Space dog reached four down. That's awesome. I see where you say in ten second category, and that's a different than the main category. But still, any achievement is something to celebrate. Well, I've bamboozled my opponent here, so I see I'm not the only one confused. Hooray. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, wait, wait, I can do this. Free push up. Okay. Yeah. I'm the best. Alright, I have no idea what to do next. I mean, I could give it back. <laughs> um, shit, I don't know, man. How do you figure this out? Do I just take a piece? Then they drop a knight? This ain't Joseki, but... Um, I'm so confused. I could drop the bishop back here, actually, but then they'd have a knight fork later. <sighs> Why is this game so complicated? Okay, fine. Let's do it this way. Show me what I've missed. Assuredly, I've missed things. Now we're working through the details of various bishop drop ideas. I played impulsively. Uh, but Space Dog, I mean, 3 Dawn in the main category is still pretty epic, isn't it? That's where, like, Del March and other folks are at.
things. So it's still quite an awesome achievement. Okay. Oh my gosh. What is going on here? They have a knight and a bishop. Um, I'll be better protected against bishop drops if my gold is defending everything. That said, now there's like potentially a hole here, but that's fine. It's fine. Nothing to worry about. Unless I forget about this square and let them drop there for free and then promote and take all my stuff. But what are the odds I'd forget about that? Me forget something? Please. Alright. Let's keep the rook on this file where it's pretty active. Um, so... Uh... Hmm, if I drop the bishop there, they drop a bishop here. And I take, they take, I drop again. Yeah, they can't stop my bishop. Nanafun. All right, let's get a bishop promotion. I mean, maybe it was safer to, like, drop a pawn and threaten to promote the pawn or something like that. I don't know. This looked simple. But... Oh gosh, they can trap my bishop, can't they? <laughs> I say this looked simple. Alright, well... I'm just asking for trouble. That said, if this gold moves, I can drop a rook, so maybe I'm correct in some sense of the word, but yeah, simple, this does not seem anymore. I thought it was simple. It's very much not. Let's check. Why you would give check here, I can only guess. Sure. Let's block the check. They'll drop it. No, they don't even drop the knight. Interesting. Um, okay, first of all, let's not get my bishop trapped. So, that's safe. It's also threatening to take here and then there. But now this bishop faces other problems, doesn't it? I... yeah, I don't know. I guess it was to test my nerves. But they seem intact. Um... So, yeah, uh, this is my field to do whatever I want, I guess. I, they have a knight in hand, and I've got a horse and a rook and another rook, and I can see where this bishop is aiming. So, um, it's very much my ball. Okay, let's take a pawn. 
they'll threaten this point, probably. Then I can push this pawn, and this pawn, and this pawn. Or, I see. They're trying to use their bishop in this way. Okay. Um, that actually has some merit. How do I stop this knight drop from being something to even have to think about? I don't. I have to think. But the knight drop doesn't do anything. It looks cute. Then I move away, and then it does nothing. Okay. Well, that said, let's just do this. They'll drop at night, or not. Um, sure. I'll promote here. So the silver can't move without dropping this pawn. The gold cannot defend this pawn. Things are stacking up. If the knight moves, I can take it, but I don't even know if I want to take it. Um, uh, yeah, this is the website Shogi Wars. Uh, Google can be your friend to Go help find it. Okay, they hit this point twice. Um... I mean, that's a threat. Do I? I'm panicking here for no reason. No reason whatsoever. They are attacking this point twice, and they have another knight in hand. So if I'm reckless, this gets out of control. Um. Hmm. This is vacant. All right. I'll give you the bishop back in hand against my better judgment. And then attack this way. Oh, so that's how people get the other background animations. I guess they use um, the phone app instead of the browser version. That's clever. Yeah. There is a setting in the settings menu to help uh, change the language. Um, forget how to navigate the settings menu. Okay. Oh, how gutsy am I feeling today? Do I chomp the pawn? Where's this bishop going? They're threatening a knight drop and then trying to do more stuff after they drop the knight. The knight. Actually, all the knight drops fail, so let's just chomp the pawn. So. Oh, this knight drop. Well, I wasn't counting that one. Let's have a do over. <laughs> Shit. Alright, well, we got an interesting situation now. Um, or I was slightly more generous than I anticipated. Um. Yeah, they're, this is menacing. You gotta be careful about stuff like this. Um, that said, I wasn't careful and I don't know what to do now. It'd be great if I had a checkmate. Um... 
I don't see me. 2分30秒。All right, let's play an attacking move. My retreat is forced. My retreat continues to be forced. Let's just keep running. I saw this much. It's nothing to be proud of, but I survive. Meanwhile, I'm threatening to take this gold. Oh, well, okay. Which do I take? We approach the king, right? But then they drop here, but then I take it. Let's keep going attacking the king. Oh, shit. I didn't see this. Um, fine. Whatever. A pawn for a pawn. Question is, do I take this or that? 1分30秒。I think this is the way to go. I'm pretty sure. So I'm threatening mate. Actually, I don't have a piece to drop that mates here. I'm threatening two golds and the king is sandwiched in between, and I have a knight and a bishop. I assumed, perhaps too much, that this position looks amazing.、Uh, I have a knight drop and a bishop drop that, like, this looks. Overpowering. So that's why I sacked the rook. I assumed that I had a mate. Don't be lazy. Don't assume. Verify. So what do we do now? They're going to drop here, and I'm going to have to pick some direction to go. Or they move the gold up, but.、Uh, that would be bold, but looks correct to me. I think if they drop here, I take this and they're in deep doo doo. I've also been ignoring like, this double exchange here. That complicates everything. So potentially, this horse might be lost to some kind of fork.、Um, Alright. Yeah, I think this was accurate. And now things are extremely messy. I should not have sacked the rook so casually. Alright, here's the double exchange. They have a rook and a knight in hand. That's a check.、Um, Think this is the way to go? Defend with a gold general. Light defense often fails, so heavy defense seems necessary. This is heavy for an attack. And they've run out of attackers.
threatens an attack on my head. Also threatens to move this gold over to continue the attack. Ah, oh, what to do? Such a mess. Sanjubio. Oh shit. This doesn't work the way I imagined. This does not work the way I imagined it. Nijubio. Okay, I missed that. I'm just gonna give up the rook. Jubio. Thanks for the game. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, three games down, three games done. Hope we've enjoyed this series. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.